Hello everyone and welcome back to Lichdom Battle Mage. So, there is unfortunately going to be a lost episode. I recorded one and the only thing that picked up was the audio and not the video. Luckily, you didn't miss really anything. It's just fighting down corridors like this and little opener, op <laughs> opener, <laughs> uh, open areas like this, killing more undead. That's all you missed. And then I came across a boss fight that's right up here and I died. That's all that was in the last episode. So, story related, you didn't miss anything. Just more combat against undead. And, when we restart this boss fight, you'll see all the dialogue between the characters. So, again, you didn't miss anything too important. Unfortunately, something that I kind of hate in video games is we can't hurt this guy until he does his little spiel. Like, I can do this right now. And he's just like, you know what, no, I don't feel like taking damage right now, I don't feel like being electrocuted. So the boss fight's gonna be him, that's uh, Rojiro, and this little, or not little, but this giant beast thing. And this beast thing can take away like two shields in one hit, so you cannot allow yourself to get close to this thing. It is pretty scary. My patience is at an end. This is where you die. Still can't hit him. Shut up, Rojiro. In the ground. Oh, really? We'll see if my friend has anything to say about that. Alright, so now I'm going to try and stun this guy. And here he's coming. Oh, I feel so slow. Oh, Jesus. Stun. Like I said, if you, he does like this ground pound move, and it does a lot of damage. So right now I'm trying to take out Rojiro and kite the big boss. And take out these arcs at the same time. Alright, so I need to wait for my shield to re recharge. So I'm going to kind of withdraw. Oh no, it's knocked down. No. There it is. There it is, just got hit. Oh my god, now I'm almost dead. Now I need to run. So one more hit from that big guy, and I'm basically dead. Oh no, I missed it. I missed it. Not good, not good, not good. Now I need to run. No! God! Uh. Son of a bitch. What made that old man think I was ready for this? Okay, now I gotta do it again. Uh, it's too bad you have to listen to all this again. My patience is at an end. This is where you die. 
Shut up, Roshiro. Putting you in the ground. Oh, really? We'll see if my friend has anything to say about that. Run, need to run. I'll try, Griffin. Get out of here. There we go. All right, so we got Rajiro. So we should be able to finish this off. Got it. Uh, Got a lot of stuff. Where's the reliquary? Where are you, Griffin? What? What's going on? Ooh, up the stairs, probably. Yeah, that seems like a good space. Alright, let's uh I guess keep going up. And there she goes. Alright. I'm going to craft and see what the heck we just got. Mmm. 
Panicked Ray. 25% damage dealt on last pip. Uh, not much with the rays. Hmm. Well. Impeccable destruction of charging. Panicked Frostbite Ray, sure. Do you have any kind of better shield stuff? Hasty Agile Shield. Hardened Strategic Shield. So I think this is the one that doesn't allow us to do the Nova stuff, but that's kind of fine. I like the being able to just kind of blink around. Ooh, we can equip two slots there, okay. So now we should be able to... Yeah. I like the quick dashes. It's... Oh, wait, wait. But we can still... Interesting. The shield that I had on before this, I wasn't able to dash backwards or dash anywhere. But with this hasty Azure shield, I guess I'm allowed to do Nova's and... Blink? Alright. That looks cool. Well, we'll see how effective it is. It does say that Ice has the largest base damage, so maybe this will be okay. You did well, Dragon. The Etheria you gathered from Rojiro now gives you the ability to fast travel between vortex pools. Useful. There are limitations. You may only travel between pools you've activated. There's always a catch, right? That's fine. Roth? Yes. Rojiro's dead, but you promised me Shax. Where is he? I believe you are ready. Come, let us plan. Ooh. Corruption. Infected with parasites. The spell's attunement dramatically changes how the spell behaves. Yeah, that sounds cool. Revenge is easy. But making things better, that's tricky. With the power of the reliquary, the dragon's real work begins. I'm not sure why he was chosen to be the dragon, or what our mutual benefactor has in mind. I do know that Roth has promised us both something. Retribution. As much as it pains me, this dragon and I will work together for now. I'll be his eyes and ears. Our first target? Count Shax, the man who took everything from us. Roth says that Shax is tied to the cult of Malthus, an ancient pack of bastards we all thought were dead. Their depravity runs as deep as the snows of the Grey Teeth Mountains. If Shax is in charge, I can believe it. I just hope this dragon is as good as Roth says he is. I don't know, I mean, I took down Rajiro and that beast thing. That's pretty good. Hello, I'm an old man in robes. I must be like a counselor or something. I guess we're going to call that robes. Nice jacket. Counselor jacket. Okay. Destroy Rajiro and the demon. So now I'm imagining we can do actual sigil. Yep, okay. Oh, what do I want to replace? Well, we can't replace that. The fire has been kind of useful. Lightning is kind of useful. I think I'll replace this one. Oh, that's right. You lose all leveling progress. Uh, definitely, then, yeah, the lightning. Because I've leveled the fire a lot more. You are doing well, Dragon. So far. So far. <laughs> Look, I saw those echoes of the other dragon. What happened to her? There have been many dragons over the years. <laughs> and what, you uh, can't keep track of them? Hmm. I remember each one. 
but there is always a need for another. Tell me straight, why me? I looked for one with the ability to harness magic. I chose you, and you haven't disappointed me yet. The previous dragon laid the groundwork. You will succeed where she did not. I'm no crusader. I just want revenge. As you wish. So, my one problem with the story thus far, well, huh, a couple problems, but this one kind of really stares out. These little gauntlets that I have, or these wrist thingies, prevent you from dying. Assuming that the dragon before me had the same things, why is she dead? I mean, either it's just like a glaring oversight on the creators of this game's part, or I guess maybe she found out something about Roth that she shouldn't have, and so Roth killed her somehow? I guess? I hope, actually, because if they just say that she died with those wrist things on, then, like, what? What are we, like, in the Himalayas? Huh. Ugh. Mass parasites. Interesting. Huh. Alright, well, let's craft. Corruption Pulp. Applies a small pustule that bursts upon critical damage, dealing 39 damage. Targets are infected by living bombs that mature after 10 seconds, and on death will spawn 10 bugs that deal 79 damage, and I have 26% chance to transfer elemental status effects. Pustule. Disgusting. Power Nova of the Arcanus. I don't really like the Nova stuff. Energizing Missile. Bombing Agility, sure. And Herod Mastery. Energizing Infestation. Why not? Oh no, it doesn't fly that far though. Oh yeah, it does. Well, kind of. All right, we got some. Tell Griffin not to worry. I made it. What? Is he talking to those birds? Wait. You hear that? <laughs> Maggots for all. Place for you. Alright, so those bursts on critical damage, right? Hmm. Oh, the race seems kind of effective. Oh, boy. It's pretty effective. It's super effective. Dragon uses polar ice ray. Ah, uh, take a moment out of this busy day to appreciate the view. Say idiot a lot. So if I'm understanding this corruption thing right. Let me see this again. It only bursts upon receiving critical damage, which fire is pretty good at. 
The critical hit increases mastery. Targets are infected by a hive that matures after 10 seconds. So only after it's been burst, bursted, that's just burst, does it then form this hive. And on death it spawns a hive. So I need to hit them with this and then destroy them with my crit fire, I guess? I don't know. Ah! How is Shax harvesting this? I have found the um, pustules from the first level. They are now ice. I hear beasts. Ice leveled up. Level up that ice. Casting speed, damage dealt, status effect duration. Hmm. I guess this. Hello. Someone hiding in there? God, it feels good to know Rajiro's dead. Now it's time to ruin Shax's day. Oh, it's long past time. Uh, something's wrong with your head. As as I do. He had my wife killed in front of me. You be the judge. Yeah, what a what a punk. Typical bad guys killing wives. Ooh, that looks kind of cool. I never noticed that before. Moon has been shattered. Just walk. The rapture comes. Ah! Oh. At this point, I don't even think I need the the parasite stuff. Right? Just kill him with this polar rays or something up here. Or is this the way to go? Oh! Take that! And they were protecting this! Better be awesome. Yeah! Basic panic trap. Awesome. Yep. Out of the way. Ha, ah, feel that. Hello, Griffin. Bracing, isn't it? I think my feet are frozen solid. I don't really trust this weather. Magic. So is the Count at home? He's dug in at his hunting lodge. I'll see if I can find you a way in. Hmm. 
All right. Well, I'm going to take this as an opportunity to say adieu to this episode. I will see you all next time and kill or continue to kill people with some ice. I guess. Why is my Nova on this blinking or like highlighted? Oh. I see. What did I do to, to do that? Because, like, now it's not highlighted any longer. Huh. Well, I'll figure that out, I guess, later. So thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Take care.